how's it going guys today i'm going to show you how to refill your um fuse alto pods uh, i've seen a lot of ways uh, to do it online and i don't really like the way they did it especially because um they they leaked after i refilled them a lot of people uh tell you to use a uh, pliers and wiggle it out if you see other videos i didn't like that because it deforms the metal piece right here and this is the way i did it and it makes it look like it wasn't even opened as you can see there and this is the way i did it <clears throat> i got a a small flathead screwdriver this is really small as you can see compared to the pod now what i did was i pushed up right here You can see it popped up right there. Grab it right there and that's where you push up. Now you go to the other side. You push up right there. And you just take it out. Pops right out. Now you're going to want to take this part out too. I stuck the, the flathead screwdriver right there and just twisted it. Came right out. And it comes out. Now some people take out the rubber part in there. I go ahead and leave it in there. And through those side holes, you just refill it. And you want to fill it up to right here, to this line. <clears throat> you don't want it to go over that because then you'll get some spit back and stuff like that Put it back together Click it into place And uh, whenever you use the pliers like in the other vi video I'll show you you always have to use force to put this back in. But if you use this method, it clicks right back in with these. And you won't have any leaks like this. As you can see, it, it doesn't even look like it was opened. There you go, guys. If you have any questions, uh, post it down in the comments and I'll get back to you. Um, and you, uh, Go ahead and subscribe and like the video if this helped you out. Thanks.